All right, here we go. We have Reggie Wright Sr., father of Live TV repeat guest Reggie Wright Jr., and former captain of the Compton Police Department. Welcome to Vlad TV. My pleasure, my pleasure. Well, you know, we've had your son on here a few times, and we had a lot of people uh, that you know and interacted with over the years, but this is the first time that we actually have you here. So I want to start in the very beginning. So you were born in New Orleans? New Orleans, Louisiana, yes. Okay, and where'd you grow up in New Orleans? In New Orleans, I was the ninth ward. I was originally I lived in the seventh ward, uh, my first two or three years, I was told by my parents, obviously. And then we moved to the Desire Projects in the Ninth Ward in New Orleans. And then in 1957, my dad and I came out to California to seek uh, a place to stay. And my dad was getting hired for the post office in L.A. So he and I came out first. And then my mother and other siblings came out about two or three months later after we got settled. And... Once we got settled, we lived in the L.A. area, uh, uh, South Central area, and then we eventually moved into the Imperial Course Projects in Watts. And uh, I remained there until I got married in, uh, when I was about 18 and lived in the area and then finally moved to Compton, and that's where I spent most of my time. Okay, so you spent a lot of time in Watts. And what was Watts like back then? So we're talking about what the... We're talking about the, the 60s? 60s, yeah. yeah. Well, actually, I went to Markham Junior High School, got out of there in 1961. That's in Watts. Then went to jo Davis Star Jordan and from 61 to about 63. And then I went to Compton High, and I uh, completed at Compton High in 65. Okay. Well, by 1969, that's when the gang thing started to really happen in Compton? Yeah. I, the, first, I, the first gangs. Well... Actually, the real stuff started up about the 74 or something like that, the real uh, Crip Piru uh, warfare. You had little cliques developing the late 60s, early 70s, but the violence really didn't start until the uh, middle 70s. Okay, and from what I understand, uh, there's a rivalry originally uh, between two high schools. There was a Sentinel high school. Centennial. Centennial High School. And then there was Compton High School. Yeah, actually, it really was three, if you want to uh, go that way, in the early 70s. Compton High was the central school. It was more or less Crip-dominated. Um, to offset some of the things that the Crips were doing, the guys started forming their own group. They wanted to get away from that Crip-type uh, coincidentally, Centennial High School basic colors were red and white. And then Dominguez on the east side, uh, they were red and gold. So in each of those respective areas, they start developing their own little blocks. Like actually the original Piru, uh, name of the Pyrus was taken from Piru Street right off of Piru and Central, where uh, Sylvester Scott put in. He lived over in that area. They started their little group, and they basically went from Piru to West Side when other areas over on the West Side started getting into that uh, that type of uh, uh, activity. Then on the East Side, it was Dominguez High School up around Lula's Park. Uh, that's uh, how they developed. They right. basically wanted to get away from the Crips, do their own thing. Now, wasn't there... I mean, I had read that there was this big basketball game that happened around 1970 where uh, Centennial and Compton played. Centennial scored like 50 points. Compton scored almost nothing. And then, like, Compton started, like, throwing bottles and bricks and bats, and then a fight broke out. And then from then on in, it was like a retaliatory back and forth. You know what I'm talking That's, about? That kind of was one of the incidents that kind of really started this rivalry. And that was about 74, 75. I wasn't on the police department at that time. I was a reserve of police. I wasn't a regular police officer, but I, I vaguely remember that incident. I think the game was at Dominguez High School uh, between Dominguez and Compton. And yes, it was a big melee. And that kind of kicked it off along with about 1975 or 76 over in the... Um, East side of Compton, near Luther's Park, it was a a swap meet over over in that area. 
off of Bullis Road, and they would have the carnival that would come on the grounds, the parking area, and they had a big carnival. And then uh, at the carnival, uh, some Crips uh, got into it with some bloods over there, and subsequently, an uh, individual was killed. That kind of kicked it off as as well as the game fight. So that's when the rivalry, basically Crip Piru rivalry, started. 